Hey Lamb Squad, guess who? It's Rebecca! Welcome to another edition of Lamb Tridivision. I am six weeks post and I haven't I haven't updated I know since on my round two infusion. Yeah, so I'm six weeks post round two. Um and so I'm going to try to give you a bit of a summary of what's been going on. Um, this whole round two experience, it's been really different from round one. And um, the recovery last year from round one, like the very next day, I was toast. Like I, I was so weak, so fatigued. And it took me a while to recover from that. And as you can remember, it was, I often described it as a roller coaster and it was like, right? Um, this year has been very different. Um, one day post round two, I felt great. I felt so good. Um, since then, it, it has been up and down, but it hasn't been as significant as last year it's been more of a like ride the waves kind of thing and a lot of times it seems just like the natural ebb and flow of ms like you just never know what you're gonna get every day is a surprise party Woohoo! what's gonna be today are we gonna be able to walk are we going to trip all over ourselves or what? So anyhow, um, and there are certain days and times where I really kind of feel like on my pre, pre-infusion and then in other ways, not so much. Um, as far as energy and everything, I guess that's seems to be evening out. Um, I did have a bit of fatigue afterwards and was having to spend a few days in bed, but not that much. Um, and I really didn't want to go backwards a lot, so I tried to stay out of bed as much as possible and moving around. Um, lately, I have been... I mean, honestly, this is part of why I haven't done a limb division. I've had trouble, I don't know if you'd say like processing or putting into words, like I can't really describe what's going on as much as it's just kind of like up and down. Um, my balance is off right now. Um, I. It's so weird though, like I really... I don't really feel like I did anything. Like as far as round two goes, like I don't really feel like I did anything significant to my body, but at the same time, my balance is off. Um, I've experienced quite a bit of spasticity in my leg and that's when like your muscles just got like tight and straight and like stiff. Um, and but it, it hasn't been every day or anything like that. Um, and I, it was really, really bad on Monday. And then I remembered that magnesium um, helps to relax muscles. And uh, so I realized, well, you know, I haven't taken my magnesium since my infusion. So I started that again and it has been so much better. Um, I still um, do have some, um, a little bit of tight, uh, tightness, I guess you could say, in certain parts, like especially in my right calf. Um, I started physical therapy last week and my therapist used this like thingamajig to kind of like roll out my muscles, so to speak. <laughs> Just rolled it up and down my legs and there was quite a bit of tightness in one area of my calf. Um, and it could be from, I don't know, MS is just weird. I mean, it could be from wearing my a AFO, but who really knows? I mean, pff, 
I don't know. But my goal the, right now is to be able to get to walking without my AFO. Um, so I do find that I need to build my strength back up um, as far as walking and endurance. Like there, there are certain physical therapy exercises that I can do better now than I could before, which is awesome. Um, I just, I have to really work hard though to maintain it. Um, in other areas, it's not quite as good. But I knew before I infused round two that there would be some stepping back, so to speak, or that's what I was guessing. Um, and I would say that for me, that has happened. Um, it's not true for everybody, but at this point in time, I am still in the rebuilding process. And I'll be honest with you, sometimes that's really mentally draining and challenging. We're like, oh, not this again. But really, honestly, I, I don't know. I think that's MS is um, in general and also going through La Trotta is really um, a mental game and you can prepare for it as much as you can and then sometimes it just wallops you and you're like oh my goodness <sighs> whoa it's me you know um I don't usually fall into that um, frame of mind very often but sometimes I do um and that that's been a bit of a challenge recently like um but i'm i'm doing better now so yay for that and um i'll be honest um something that god reminded me of was that not everything that sometimes i need to experience certain things so that i can identify with other people in a better way um and be there for them or whatever i can do to try and help so um you know what that was really really encouraging to me and um anyways that's kind of where i am right now and yeah so thanks so much for watching i really hope that you have a lovely day I'll talk to you later now. Ta-ta. Bye.